The digital search for love in 2020 is a lot more complicated. Now add a global pandemic, sheltering in place, and hashtag stay home orders, and it's a whole new world for singles seeking a soulmate. My first virtual date. I'm putting on a black dress. I would love to take you on a virtual date. Well, let's go! Tiffany Haddish and Common made a serious COVID connection. Welcome to the virtual dating world. You look very beautiful. You even be dating during COVID. Why not? Oh my God, are you kidding me? It's time to get out of the box. Why not COVID? But get this, by the end of 2020, a year of hardship for so many other industries, Match Group is projected to gross a heart-throbbing $2.3 billion. We saw an 80% increase in messaging. I even started an event called Meet Your Match. We've matched over 100 people during this pandemic. One of Stacey J's matches, Today Tiffany and Myron. My abs were hurting because I was laughing so hard. She's a Cali girl. He's a Texas guy. If it wasn't for COVID-19, I wouldn't have never met Tiffany at all. They haven't met yet. Instead, have focused on FaceTime hangouts and a flourishing friendship. I do plan to meet Tiffany in person. Lady, you can actually go on a date without wearing heels. Like, do it. <laughs> Other stars who found a deeper love in COVID, model Winnie Harlow and LA Laker Cal Kuzma didn't let the virus socially distance them, while Ben Affleck and his new girlfriend, actress Ana de Armas, committed to quarantining together.